What do you like and dislike about living in LA? Um, I, the rat race is crazy. You know, if you're not working, I don't know what, when are you not working in LA? You know what I mean? But um, I do like the fact that the ocean is 20 minutes away from me no matter where I'm at. And uh, George Carlin said something really cool. He said, if you go to the ocean, like if you live on the ocean, you only got assholes on three sides of you. <laughs> no, I feel like such a lesbian right now. I'm like, I watch this, I'm working a lot for lesbian companies and um, doing a lot of girl girl work um, just because people think I'm good at it or something, you know? And uh, and I watch this full on real lesbian company, they're called Triangle Films, and I just watched my scene that I did with them last night and I'm like, I'm a fucking dyke, man. Uh, you know, and I'm like, wonder why people think I'm such a lesbian. <laughs> but I, I really like guys, you know, so. Really? I really do. You'd yeah. rather make out with I, a girl. Well, I would rather you make out with. I know. Such I'd rather bag. I'd rather make out with a female talent than male talent right. because male talents fucking gross. Do you do scenes with guys? Yes, I do. Okay. Was there a time when you did not? There was a six-month period after I did Naked and Famous that I didn't want to work with guys. I was. Um, I was. I couldn't even look at a penis. What happened in Naked and Famous? Um, it's not what happened, it's just like penis overload and the fact that my my fiance at the time was shooting it and like it was really uncomfortable. Like I, I don't like performing with men in front of my man. But then like doing six months of just girl girl and mm -hmm. being like a, like a real porn star and doing dudes and stuff, you know, I got bored really quick. I was like, if I see another vagina, now I'm gonna get, you know, so I went back, you know. What's the best way of dealing with penis overload? Um, take a break. Take a fucking break. That's all, you know. And, you know, it's natural to, to get sick of, like, working all the time. Well, having sex. Let's not, let's not beat around the bush, okay? Working is fucking, you know, and yeah, fucking, you know, all the time can get really, um, really mundane and, you know, just take a break and get your head straight. How has it affected your personal love life during some of your professional scenes? You know, I mean, in my time, I haven't done as many scenes as most girls have done in a year nowadays, you know what I mean? But, um, I, I love making love to my man, you know what I mean? And I am completely normal, sexually, at home. You know, I, pref I prefer to have a normal relationship, you know? And I am a home buddy, I'm not all about, you don't see me at parties very often, do no, you, Luke? No, no I, I'm, I'm at home, you know? So, you know, I understand that, you know? So do you ever like, wind up in a, in a cold in a ball in your shower, like screaming, why me, why me? All the time. And I bet you do too, and everyone else on this fucking set, why me? I got myself into a bed, and I guess I'm gonna lay in it for the rest of my life. Yeah. Oh yeah. Every day. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>